Once upon a time, on a dark and thunderous day, there was an explosion. <coughs> Little Red Riding Hood was born. She was real pretty. Mm -mm. I'm real pretty. I'm getting out of this hellhole. So, Little Red Riding Hood thought she deserved better and moved out of her mama's house. On the way out of the hellhole, Mama had a message for Little Red Riding Hood. Red Riding Hood, can you bring these apples to Grandma? And now, SCRAM! Before Little Red Riding Hood left, Mama had a second message for Little Red Riding Hood, which was very important. Please make sure Grandma get the apples to brown topping. On the way to Grandma's house, lurking in the jungle, was a big bad wolf. <coughs> Little Red Riding Hood bumped into the big bad wolf. Something smells yum. Could I have some, please? Ah uh ah! -uh. These are for my granny. They ain't for you. My granny is just leave down the road. And off, little Red Riding Hood, down the road, to her grandma's house. The big bad wolf has his own cunning plan. Ha ha ha! I'll get her when she's off guard. The big bad wolf went on to execute his evil plan. With his GPS, the big bad wolf finally found Granny's house. He hid under the thick blanket next to the little boy. I will wait till Red Riding Hood has arrived. Then I will steal her apples with the chocolate topping. Little Red Riding Hood finally arrived at Granny's house. She opened the front door. She thought she had seen Granny. Grandma, I brought you some yummy apples with some chocolate toppings. Please enjoy. And then, Little Red Riding Hood handed Grandma the basket of apples. The big bad wolf started eating the apples. The apples with the brown topping are yummy. Yum, yum, yum. After having an apple with the brown topping, the big bad wolf suddenly felt a sharp pain in the tummy. He fell from his bed and somersaulted onto the floor. I'm dying! I've been poisoned! The big bad wolf died a terrible death. There was blood coming out of his eyes, blood pouring out from his gut. After healing the big bad wolf, 
little red riding hood didn't even took pity on the big bad wolf. She was laughing cunningly. <laughs> Moral of the story, never take food from a stranger. And don't become a vegan if you are a carnivore. And lastly, never trust a pretty face with a red hood. I hope you enjoy watching my video. Please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. This is a youngster man in the gangster man. Yippee yippee yeah. Yippee yippee hop. One two three four three four. This is a youngster man in the gangster man. Yippee yippee yeah. Yippee yippee hop. One two three four three four. This is a youngster man in the gangster man. Yippee yippee yeah. Yippee yippee hop. One two three four three four. This is a youngster man in the gangster man. Yippee yippee yeah.